Greetings. Thank you so much for giving us the opportunity to come your way as we start a brand new week. It's a joy to be able to spend a few moments in the Word of God and in prayer with you. Just remember that the joy of the Lord is our strength. So maintain your joy. Keep your joy up. Stay joyful in Him. This week, we want to take some time just to remind ourselves of something which all of us are very familiar with, uh, but it's always good to be reminded of these things, about learning to recognize the times of God's working in our personal lives. You see, usually, uh, as many of us, as we go about our day, uh, we might turn around to somebody and say, what time is it? And we ask the question because we want to know uh, the time of day. And then once we know the time of day, we then decide what we're supposed to do. You know, if it is time for breakfast, you get your breakfast. If it's time for lunch, you go for lunch. If it's time to keep an appointment, you go for the appointment. So we are conscious of what time of day it would be so that we can determine the action that needs to be taken. Now the same simple and yet very important truth or a concept or idea applies to our walk with God. The Bible tells us, and it's a verse we are all familiar with, Ecclesiastes chapter 3 verse 1, to everything there is a season a time for every purpose under heaven. And our lives are also has its times and seasons. And God appoints these times and seasons in our lives and He helps us journey through life in seasons, in various times uh, that He ordains for us. And it is important for us to know what time it is in God's working and God's dealing with us. We need to look to God and as we commune with Him, He gives us the discernment, the understanding to recognize the time in which we are personally in our walk with God, in our journey through life. What is the time or what is the season that God is taking us through. What is the time? What is the season? He's getting us ready for. All these things are important for us to be aware of so that we will know what we should be doing. We will know what we should be pursuing and we will know how we should be living our life. So this week, we're going to learn a few things about recognizing various times that God has appointed in our lives and thereby what should our purpose, what should our way of life, a manner of life be in different times or in different seasons of life. The psalmist said in Psalm 31 and verse 15, he said, my times are in your hands. I want you to know that your times are in, are in God's hands. And as He orchestrates those times, you, might, you and I must recognize it and live correctly, aligned to the timing of God in our lives. Let's pray as we begin this week together. Father, we pray that You will help us recognize Your timing in our lives and help us to un align ourselves to your timing, to your season in our lives and journey with you through the times and seasons you appointed for us. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.